Hey guys, welcome back to some more Minecraft. Tam plays MC. I believe this is episode 45. So, as you can see, there's the palace over there. It's gonna look beautiful, gorgeous once we get it all done. But anyways, I'm at the little village that isn't too far away from it. And I, I, I was just watching a video and it looks like we can't trade with just a normal villager anymore because they've, they've done something with the trading. You can... I believe you can assign, well, you can place down beds, and then a villager will just pick that bed, I believe, and it'll sleep in it. But you can also, there's a way to give, I think, villagers, villagers jobs, but I think it's up to them on what profession they choose. Okay, so I'm going to place some beds in here. Let's see what happens, see if anybody claims them. There's a smithing table that I have right here. And this supposedly gives them their jobs. So I'm gonna place one there and a couple there. I'm gonna see, yeah, this guy has a job now. How many more? Uh, that dude does it. Oh, he's got a job. All right. Now we can trade with him, sweet. Look, we can get, we can trade him coal, which we got a bunch right here for emeralds. Nice. So he is a uh, novice, if that's what he's. Well, it says toolsmith, so I guess he's a toolsmith. Maybe the novice was like. Oh, maybe that's the next thing that'll be. Well, let's let's try and do this trade. So give him some coal. I want to trade with you, and apparently you can max out the trades. Two, three, four. All right, so let's see. All right, so I guess he's changing. Ooh, look at that, he's holding the emerald. Cool. Almost looks like Iron Man. So I'm not for sure if the color of the bed has anything to do with it. Okay, let's, let's trade with you. Oh, okay, so now his next thing will be an apprentice, I think. Or maybe he is an apprentice. And we can do some more trades with him, so that's cool. So if I want to... Well, I want to max... Ooh. Ooh, he's thinking about something. Maybe he's happy. He had particles just go up. Aha, okay, so he, I believe... When there's an X like that, it means that he doesn't have any more stock for that for that trade currently. So I think when it's nighttime, he'll go to his bed that I guess he chose. And then he will be able to, I think, go to one of these tables. And then it will, like, restock the next day. All right. So I believe you can do this with a lot of different villagers. Look, we got a bunch of villagers out here. Okay, so let's give some more beds. Okay, and then we only got one more smithing, or two more smithing tables. Because I was wondering what these what these did, and apparently you can't interact with them. I think they're just for the villagers. So we should see some villagers going to Sleepy Town very soon. I want to see, uh, who is that villager that, or the one that I was talking to? Okay, it's not him. Hmm, you can get access from this guy. I've seen that you can eventually get, like, enchanted tools and stuff. Maybe even weapons. If these guys are close enough to a bed, they will sleep in it. I should have probably gotten a bell. Oh, we need 36. We need 30. Ooh. So I'm wondering if if we do enough trades with him, if he gives us a deal. So maybe that's why it's 33 emeralds. Okay. Uh, anybody going to sleep town? Are you able to? I don't want anybody to die out here. Oh, no. Please, everybody go to Sleepy Town. I probably should leave this place or sleep. I know I was saying I, I shouldn't sleep, but uh, it's to save these villagers' life. 
Yeah, I guess nobody's claimed a bed yet. I probably gotta get them closer, and then they'll claim the bed. Is what I'm thinking. If I just break this door, will that encourage anybody to pick a bed? I'm gonna make a boat. But I don't have wood. Yeah, I'm gonna get a villager inside of a boat, and then... Take them close to a bed. Hey, I hope you are having a wonderful Saturday. I mean, Saturday is the day that I'm recording this, so... I'm going to try and get this all edited and then uploaded today. It shouldn't be too bad because it's only like 10 minutes. All right. Don't need you, don't need you, zombie flesh. Alright, let's see if this will work. There we go. Come with me. That's right. I guess this is one way to get villagers. To come with you. All right, claim a bed. Claim a claim a bed, hopefully. Oh, I can't make it through there. Oh, did he claim a bed? Maybe. Work at one of the tables. Oh, you hear that? Alright, he's working there. Alright, that was splendid. Ooh, this guy. Come on, come on. Aha, they just, I think, just wanted to be close enough. No, it's okay. You can come inside. Don't be shy. Alright, he's working there. Dude, you can come in. Alright. Now, I don't know if if these guys have claimed a bed yet. Possibly. Uh, since this is the next day, who is that dude that I was trading with? You? Yes, but your one trade is still locked. So maybe it's wanting me to trade, do some different trades. Uh, we don't have iron. Get some picks. Does that help you at all? I'm wondering if it's like we have to wait a full day cycle. Ah, okay, that trade's locked. This one... He wants 20 coal. Wow, okay. So I need 20 coal to get that. These ones I could do if I just had... Oh, but he dropped the price. Remember, that was 33 before. Now it's only 32. Okay. Uh huh. so I'm wondering, the more you, you level them up, maybe the more they like you, and then they'll give you better deals. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, you, sir, I don't... I need more coal. Well, I think that's... I mean, this is like about 10 minutes. So... I think I will leave it here, but we will definitely try and get more of these tables and try and get this whole village, like, getting job. I mean, doing jobs and stuff. Because that will be good for them. Because uh, we still have a lot of villagers here, and I, I noticed that I didn't have any of these filled up. I'm wondering if I uh, used a... If I gathered all this before and just didn't replant. So I replanted some carrots. So that should help them out and we can keep planting more and more hopefully we'll get like some farmers i'm wondering if i place some of those smithing tables if i place them around the farms if that will help them be farmers or supposedly a villager is kind of smart enough with its ai so depending on what the village needs it will i think change to that to have that type of job and it will also keep all the levels that it acquired from your trading so well, yeah, I hope you guys have a wonderful, fantastic day, and I'll see you guys in the next video. So take care. Bye-bye.